Are you serious? Are you serious? Good morning, everyone. I'm just trying to get my cup of coffee started, but we've got a shooting. We've got a shooting at the Washington, D.C. Uh, Navy Yard. There's been another shooting. This happened in 2013, if you remember. We have another one. There's an active shooter loose. We have no idea how many shooters. We don't know how many people have been shot, injured, if any. But uh, there is something seriously taking place at the Washington Navy Yard right now. Breaking news. Uh, let me just see if I can get a quick update in the last few seconds here. Um, the Navy Yard, of course. Of course, and I was just doing a report on the fact that the FBI, all FBI agents, none of them are going to take the 4th of July off because... They, uh, there is high probability of an attack, a terrorist attack on the 4th of July weekend by ISIS. Yes, I have a report here. U.S. Park Police and Metropolitan Police Department officers are responding to the Navy Yard in Washington, D.C. for a report of an active shooter. No casualties at this time. Police cars are seen there. Sirens are rushing to the scene. An employee inside the, the Navy Yard reports that alarms are sounding. The buildings are on lockdown. South Capitol Street uh, to uh, Virginia Avenue are closed, and we do not know any other details. Active shooter, don't know how many people have been shot, or if any, but the police are swarming the place. Here we go again. It's at the Washington Navy Yard, and we don't know the situation from there. I'll come back and get you up to speed. Obviously, this is a fluid situation. This is just happening uh, in real time. So as soon as I get a more clarity of what's taking place, come back and let you know here on YouTube. So just pray for our nation's capital. Pray for America because the terror alert level is sky high, folks. The FBI is extremely concerned and so is Department of Homeland Security for this 4th of July weekend. Pray for America.